Hey, baby, Sunshine Goddess 333, good afternoon, guys. So, um, you guys do know a 7-Eleven. You better go get your Slurpees. They're free on 7-Eleven. So, I just had to say that, yes. <laughs> I used to, when we were little, we, when I lived down south when I was little, we would walk there like every other hour just to get our free Slurpees, take turns. I That was like one of the funnest things I ever did with my cousins that live in Virginia. So, energy to energy, Rezé. Don't forget to check out my story. Don't forget to check out my shorts, all that good stuff, okay? So, spirituality the will card i'm committed to my spiritual path and growth as i raise my consciousness i become a source of light to the world new beginnings end of delays a change in direction that offers happiness somebody's just ready to be happy okay so spirit can you clarify this spirituality happiness for me please somebody's understanding that healing and that God is the source and healing from for their connection, for their self, for their life. And they know that God will not bring me something to it if he will not bring me through it. Okay, so Spirit, can you clarify this this will card? New, end, new beginnings, end of delays. Okay, so this calls for a celebration. Whatever you were doing in the past that wasn't right for you or you felt conditioned to or it was low vibrational for you, that has changed. Okay, Spirit, can you clarify this? the source and understanding yeah because somebody went inside spirituality is about waking up went inside and said listen i've got to change things i've got to grow i've got to arrange my consciousness i've got to become this source of light to the world Woo! many are called few or chosen this person's deciding to answer the call okay spirit can you clarify the will celebration and condition yeah because this person i'm telling you guys once you go to the side of spirituality you won't nothing will ever be the same again because nothing even matters nothing will ever be the same again so it's like you're locked out of that low vibrational life and stuff this person's like you know what? i'd rather become an outsider to change than to stay stuck some people swear that they grow and they never grow yeah i, I mean maybe in their personal life but like if you're broadcast casting a growth i like to see it too you know what i'm saying spirit can you clarify this turning in energy please yeah what ready for this new beginning so this person saying, listen i'm grow and i'm about to show you how much i've grown spirit can you clarify this outside energy consciously because i feel like this person in the past this connection that you was this person they purposely made you feel like an outsider they wanted you in their life they always wanted new beginnings but it's like they purposely it's like once you started moving on from your life from this person it's like they consciously like try to push you away yeah and they did it in like such a way that you didn't realize so if you were in separation with your person and you guys were going through the outs and you're like you were sure that it was okay that it was over they would wheel you back in okay because this person knows how spiritual you are this person knows that third party situations don't do nothing for them third party situations don't do nothing for them they want to go where the spirituality is at baby they don't want to feel like an outsider to this connection because outside of you they get nothing outside of you nobody treats this person the way you do nobody does okay so they're saying listen i might as well come on over to the spirituality side that's that's where it's really lit that's where it's at okay spirit can you clarify turning in and beyond illusions what do we got here passionate encounter so this person after having sex with you Aaliyah rocked the boat after having sex with you they said who this is really like a spiritual bay okay try again literally consciousness the will end of delays okay this person and look at Aaliyah came out twice I'm telling you guys me and Aaliyah we've been like this okay this person if they didn't succeed in this connection they're coming back to try again okay so can you clarify passionate encounter breaking generational change and curses okay spirituality this person saying I'm gonna understand I'm gonna heal this I want to do something good I don't want to be on the outside I don't want to be on the outside of spirituality this person saying okay so can you clarify this try again literally energy please empath narcissist divine peridium this person knows that every time that you only when you're lonely this person they're realizing because they were karmic i'm telling you when they started getting lonely and stuff and they seen you moving on with your life they wanted to come back okay and 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 they've tried again and again and now that's this time when they come back in your life it's not to condition you to deal with them and be with third parties it's not to try to treat you like an outsider it's not to get their way and be narcissistic with you it's because they learn and in the past this person was very narcissistic because every time you leave this connection or try to go on your way or anything like that they want to pull you back and it's because they were lonely it's a difference big difference okay spirit can you clarify this beyond illusions energy oh my god the homosexual calling tyrone this person feels the energy i'm feeling is this person feels like they're nowhere near your level or they weren't at the time then they got into their spiritual and they're like i could do this okay maybe even having some issues with with um 
different oh what do we have here on the floor family and friends again this somebody really wants their friends to help um i don't i just don't like that word hobosexual like what does that really mean like this is just weird to me let me see something i want to know what google has to say about this A person sexually attracted to tramps. There you go. Wow. Now we figured out. This person, Tyrone. So this person, okay. Ah, now I get it. See, it's making sense. I told you because they met a spiritual base. So this person used to deal with low vibrational people that just got their shit off. They didn't care. They didn't care. This person, they don't care. They didn't care. They don't, they, they care now, but they did it. They were just attracted to people that they could just get off with. Like, they, they weren't really in for the soul until they met their twin flame soul. My connection, they're like, oh, shit. I know what this is. I like how this feels. Okay, so Spirit, let's clarify this. Because I found my other card that I was looking for, guys. Let's clarify this. Spirit, can you clarify breaking general change and curses? Joy, reflection, and consciousness. Why would you not want to be happy? Why would you, why would, this person's like, no, I'm going to stay in my high ass vibration. I'm going to be happy. I'm going to do what I got to do. Okay. So can you clarify passionate encounter, please? Insight. You, Amethyst, okay? Dance of Crystalline Rainbow Fairies. You provide this person with spiritual insight. Remember the purple loyalty is royalty, baby. So the homosexual men that like sleeping with women that like to sleep around inspiration at first this person thought that it was cool to be in that energy they thought there's no brownie points in sleeping with low vibrational people they steal your energy you thought it was cool before but it's not until you got stds burned used and abused ran down on the bitch twice okay so energy energy if it resonates red spirit can you clarify try again literally please how's this person feel about trying again keeping the faith this person this energy they're they're saying listen i'm gonna come back in and try to be in your life again no matter what you say no matter what you do this person saying, i'm growing spiritually i'm growing spiritually i'm growing now and they want to come back in and try this connection again they're keeping faith this person this person feels like their spiritual bay is their guardian angel okay spirit can you clarify only when you're lonely and past nar narcissistic divine masculine protection if spirit takes him out of your life, it's for your protection. Rejection is for your protection. Until this person, Archangel Michael, protect of all, until this person can be who you need them to be, God will not let them come in your life. Don't play, okay? Spirit, can you clarify family and friends? Gratitude. The support of family and friends helps strengthen this connection. And this person needed their family and friends to realize that nothing comes out of being bad. I've got to be a better person. Nothing comes out being good. And many are called fear control. This person is saying, if I'm getting called by spirit, the hell, I'm going with this. They're saying, I'm going to take this adventure, healing childhood traumas as well, and then in the interim. Energy to energy, if it res and it Central goddess crew, yes, baby, this is what I'm talking about. No cards at the bottom of the deck. No cards at the bottom of the deck. Okay, spirit, can you clarify joy for me, please? date night if i rule the world somebody's gonna come in they like somebody really likes being around you they want to come in they just want to have a good time she just want to have a good time they want to come in they want to have a good time and they just want to take you out okay breaking generational change and curses this person just wants to have a good time with you okay spiritually they know i feel like you meet a divine masculine that's really spiritual feminine and they're gonna just want to talk about spirituality the whole time because they're gonna have a great time okay spirit can you clarify passion encounter insight getting to know you feeling feeling lo feeling loss or feeling trapped loss of self-respect so this person i feel like they want to can get to know you but they also want to sleep with you too and they they kind of don't want to be in that energy or they may feel like that like if some type of way in the past you've dealt with people that just try to try to control you sexually they want to come and get to know you but they want to have sex with you too okay so spirit can you clarify that's why i was wondering why i picked up my karma sutra tear i'm like sex Sex, I mean, so they this person feels like you'll blow their mind before you even touch them. They know, they know, they can just tell. They know, guys, women, everybody knows what they like, and when they see what they like, they're gonna go get it. Okay, so Rick, can you clarify getting to know you? Passionate encounter nine of swords this person's nervous they're so they're so attracted to you that they're nervous and anxious about even having sex with you wow this is so funny yeah look at six of pentacles but they know that you will satisfy them they know this person knows look at what the king of cups energy they know this person wow they know that you will come and satisfy them like no other no other and look at this bottom of the deck 
satisfaction and worth waiting for had to stay had to stay onto the dresser so this is so they so this person and they come in they're not going to rush you for sex just know that they're like they can't even wait like they they can't wait okay spirit can you clarify the homosexual that likes to sleep with tramps okay you know what i'm saying people like who they like but the only reason why that they like to sleep with these low vibrational people is because they don't got to put work in course and why would you not want to be with someone or something you don't got to put work in you they don't got to raise their consciousness to be in these people like easy peasy easy shit they like easy shit who doesn't like easy shit and this person they're realizing although they like easy women and stuff it's like why would you leave a woman that has a full-time job for someone that doesn't have nothing just to call them a bum because it's that control it's just what they want to do in life to, that makes them feel better okay so spirit can you clarify this inspiration and they sit up all night Faith and destiny, they sit up all night worrying about the shit that they did to you. That things will work out in the end. That these tramps did nothing to them but cause STDs, steal their money, time, energy, and resource, not only away from you, or but their kids. All this energy that people worry about with drama and shit could be used on their kids. But then again, this is the type of people that they like to deal with. These are the type of situations that they like to deal with. So we just have to let them deal with it. But in the interim, they're saying, listen, you inspire me. I'm hoping that we can work out in the end because those other people didn't suit me at all. Sunshine Goddess Crew, energy to energy. If it resonates, rent. try again. Literally, this person thinks you're not going to want them or be with them because they put you in third party situations because it's gross. Like, you know what I'm saying? And they lied. They told you that they weren't dealing with other people, that they weren't sleeping with other people. They lied. So they want to come back and have the faith and try again. Okay, Spirit, can you clarify a narcissistic empath, divine masculine, change of heart, protection, feeling bad. They consciously feel bad. Listen, sometimes guys don't want to deal with you or be with you because they can't be right for you. You have to applaud them. If a man or woman cannot be what you need in, your, in their life, and they say, listen, I can't do them like that. I can't dog them out that like that. Regardless of twin flame soulmate connection, it's better that you just stay away from them so you don't get hurt. But this energy that I'm picking up as this person is, they, they're ready to be spiritual. They're ready for their spiritual bay and they're open for love and they're ready. They're grateful for this connection. They're grateful for this adventure. If they came in and you didn't accept them back or anything, that they would be heartbroken. But like, but we have to take heed to warnings and what people tell us the first time. Sundry Goddess Crew, energy to energy. If it resonates, it resonates. Okay, so let's just clarify. So we can clarify for the overall energy open for love, please. You. One, two, three in the clock, baby. You are this person's wish fulfillment. And now that they're on the other side, they came to spirituality. They want their spiritual bay and they want their wish fulfillment. I love you guys. Keep your head up and your heart close to God, baby. Happy Mondays. And I'll catch you guys on my midday mix or when I treat whatever comes first. Mwah.